Before we jump into this video at Walmart and actually Lowe's clearance also, I'm gonna tell you about this super awesome online deal that you can do right now. It's still available at least at the time I'm making this video. It's no longer available. I'll try to add that to the description box and the comments of this video. Got the Echo Dots on Amazon really cheap during Christmas time and that was a super awesome deal. You can play uh, music on there. It's basically an Amazon Alexa. The whole time I've had the Echo Dots, I've said there's only one thing that would make this better and that would be to be able to say in my car, hey, Alexa play whatever well there's a super awesome deal now on a Amazon Alexa except for your car plus you get four months of Amazon unlimited music anyway it's like 67% off I'll put that deal in the description box and the comments of this video if you've ever thought about getting Alexa jump on that right now because it's it's truly a good deal we have a huge clearance sale going on at Dollar General this weekend I need to make a video about that so I really don't have time to make this video but I know you guys love stock pile shelves as I do so I'm gonna make you a quick video so you can look for these items at your Walmart to see if you can find any on clearance you guys I'm freaking out a little bit never find good clearance at my store but something that dill shoppers love is stockpile shelves and I found some for over 50% off epic dill I'm gonna show you some of the clearance and unmarked clearance I found in this video and I'm gonna tell you how you can find some too this is a really good coupon you should get that if you see it don't get mad at me uh, a dollar off two pop tart, six counter larger. Don't mind if I do. Thank you very much. Uh, what? Another really good one. A dollar off two Doritos, Cheetos, or Ruffles. Use with that Dollar General store coupon for Pepsi and chips. On Ibotta, a lot of these uh, back to the roots grow kits there's a ten dollar i bought a rebate it does expire it says in three days there's one for mushroom one for tomatoes i scanned these there's also a ten dollar rebate on those just depending on what you want if you want to try these which i'm going to pick up a couple uh you might want to do this rebate before it expires my i bought a referral code and link will be linked in the description box of this video wow somebody left a coupon for tide pods in my walmart it doesn't expire until the 8th I probably have coupons for these. I could kick myself in the ass for not bringing them in because I need laundry detergent. We have some Ibotta rebates. I believe it's $3 back on the small bags, which they're $4.94, so that makes your final cost $8.94. And then there's also some money back on the larger containers. I'll put the rebate uh, and the coupon here on the screen for you. The heaters will start to clearance down soon. I was at Lowe's yesterday and their heaters are already on clearance. You guys know I have a special place in my heart for rugs for some reason. I am absolutely obsessed with them. And I was here like two weeks ago and I noticed that a lot of the rugs were on clearance. This would be a really good thing to keep an eye on because yeah, they're not that great of clearance right now. For example, this one was $49, now $30. I don't know, I think that's something like 40% off. But if they don't sell at that price, I've noticed that they do go down further eventually at my Walmart. How people find a mark clearance at their Walmart is the items go down in price on clearance, of course. Uh, either they are marked one price and then they go down even lower or just marked the first time. But the associates don't have time to come and change the price and mark it down lower. If you suspect an item is on clearance at your Walmart but it's not marked, you can open up your Walmart app, hit the little search bar at the top or the little barcode in scan the item's barcode and it will tell you the exact price for that store right that moment. Of course, can find these scanners also in store and scan the item's barcode to get a price. I'll also be putting the links in the description box of this video, so make sure you check the description box of the video. The price might be higher on the Walmart website when you click the link, but keep an eye on that item. It might go lower online or in store. So you can get the item's barcode or UPC and search for it on 
on BrickSeek.com. Time to look for clearance is when the seasons change. This is just a little in cap. See, my store is pretty good at marking things down, but if your store is not good at marking things down, that's like jackpot for you. But when the seasons change, you want to think about what type of items would go on clearance. It's obvious, sometimes not. You can also kind of Google search what was on clearance at Walmart last year. That will give you a good idea of what's on clearance this year. Some of these are like 50% off. These wall sconces are really pretty. They're almost 50% um, off. I guess that would be like 40% off. There's a lot of clearance items over here in like the candle section. This item is a little bit more than 50% off actually. See, this particular candle was $7.88. They marked it down to $5. Since then, it's went down to $4. Nobody's changed the price, though. Yankee candles were $19.87, now $7. That a lot of the decorative pillows are also clearanced out. Don't forget to check the uh, top shelf or the sky shelf, some people call it. They may have just not been moved down here yet, but they may also be on clearance up there, although you may have to ask somebody for help. A lot of these are about 40% off, I guess some even more and some of them are really nice my store still has a lot of the christmas toys on clearance should start going down a little bit more really soon and then the clearance aisle over here is just packed with toys there's also some like personal care stuff that's priced really well it's just a good time to look for clearance in general. My store had these Christmas Yankee candles for $11. I seen everybody else's went down in price. They were originally like 20 bucks. I've seen them today and they're ringing up for $5 at my store. So if your store has some of these left, you might want to check. Lots of tools, but they sold out really quickly. When I was here, I think like two weeks ago, they had a ton of tools on clearance. These were almost $5. Now a dollar. I'm going to pick up a package of those. I'm also getting these wall sconces. And I have another candle in there. I've been making those cups and I need spray adhesive for the cups. It's really expensive, but this is on clearance. It was almost $10, now just $5. That's a super awesome deal. I noticed a few weeks ago that a lot of the shelving over here in like the tool section at Walmart is clearance. Here's one. This one was regularly $84. It's now marked at $64. This is, I actually really like this shelf because it's like a cabinet and you can't see what's in it. This would be great for crafting. And then there was some other ones as well they have sold some of them actually that they had my store had a lot and then there's things like this tool bench that was $197 now $154 I have a whole bunch of these little tool carts over there they were $128 now $99 since those items are marked when they are a very low price they sell out very quickly so since I seen those items on clearance I knew that I was going to pay attention to to the price and if it went down further things tend to go down slower at my Walmart than other Walmart I noticed that this shelf here this muscle rack 5 shelf was sitting on the shelf down here kind of by itself so I just happened to scan it because it was the only one and it come up regularly priced at $79 so might as well say $80 but it's on clearance in store for just $30 now online the online price is a little bit more. I believe it was $59. I'll put the online price on the screen and I'll also link it in the description box so you can find the exact item on walmart.com or the Walmart app. I was at Lowe's yesterday so I'm going to show you some of the stuff I found and got at Lowe's on clearance. I never really thought to look for like home decor and stuff like that at Lowe's but I guess after the seasons change and like right now would be a good time to look for items at Lowe's. I needed to waste some time the other day and I went to Lowe's and I seen this stool that was regularly like 80 bucks. It was on clearance for I think 39 and I went home and immediately regretted not buying the stool because it was the perfect height that I needed a stool. Uh, so I just went back to Lowe's and I happened to notice that all of these things were on clearance. I was actually filming for a 
DIY that I think I'm going to do on my second channel. I'll link that below. Um, but I'm just showing you that some of these tags say new lower price and they're yellow. Those are actually not clearance at Lowe's. They just lowered the price. The ones that are clearance say clearance, just like this one right here. Uh, if you needed to redo your floors or something, now would be a good time. These signs are actually meant for Christmas. Um, some of them at least, but like this one says market. It's super cute. If you do like farmhouse decor, uh, or something like that, these signs were regularly crazy. I think like $49 now, $15. I would never pay $49 for a sign. I would just make it myself, but these are the Christmas ones. These are now like as low as six twenty five were $25 and on, these were so so cute I think I go through them and show them and look I hope it's not like super boring obviously you would have just clicked out of the video if you thought it was boring to just look at clearance but wait till you see this stole I am obsessed with this stole I kind of want to go back and get matching stoles now just in case I ever have like a bar that needs matching stools. Okay. I have a problem. Um, there's the stool right there. It's a saddle stool. It's very nice quality. I don't know. I really love the stool. Anyway, some mattresses just went down. Some of them are on sale, like $200 from what the price was. So that's really good. This little double door unit was over a thousand dollars now only 450. That's pretty crazy guys so much i hope this video was helpful make sure you subscribe and you can watch the dollar general clearance sale video if it's up already right here i also did a video about simple meal planning on a budget i'll link those videos in the description box